Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you how to find the full current on a circuit. So the problem states, in the single phase circuit shown below, when the switch is in position 1, the current I1 is 437 amps. When the switch changes to position 2, a fault occurs at point F. What is the fault current so here's our circuit, here's the voltage surge, here's the inductance, X1, here's the uh, current flowing, here's the switch 1, and this is position 2, position 1, here's the resistance, and here's the uh, fault. So first, we found the value X1 inductor, then since we know the impedances, for both elements, we calculate the full current when the switch is in position 2. So what is a full current? A full current is an abnormally high and unintended flow of electrical current that occurred when there is a short circuit or other failure in the electrical system. Now back to the calculations. So we have voltage equals 1500 volts, resistance 2.4 ohms, and the current is 437 amps. So we're going to find X1 for the inductance. We have the voltage. We will divide it by the current one, and that will give us 3.4 ohms. Now we're going to solve for the full current. So we have the voltage, 1500 and then we have the impedances, the uh, resistance plus the uh, induct inductance, so be 2.4 ohms plus J3.4 ohms. In order to solve for this, we take the magnitude, so 2.4 square plus 3.4 square, then we do the square root, we get 4.18. So 1,500 volts divided by 4.18, and that will give us 358 amps. Well, if you like this type of content, give it a like and comment below. If you have any questions, and thank you.